Good afternoon, Colin here with TechOut, and today we're going to be checking out three cases from spec for the Galaxy S23 Ultra, um, and those are going to be the Presidio Grip 2, the Presidio uh, Perfect Mist, and the Perfect Clear, and these were sent out uh, to me to check out by spec, so thank you for that. Um, as always, though, all opinions are my own, and I have used spec cases long before they sent me anything for review. Um, the Presidio Grip was actually my go-to case back in the iPhone 4S days. So I've been using these cases for quite a while and they always hold up and they're always very, um, very nice to have on my device. Um, the Grip one is probably one of my favorite cases. Like I said, been using those on a bunch of different devices since the 4S days. Um, so we're gonna save that one for last. We're gonna save the best for last. Um, we're gonna do, let's see, we'll do the Perfect Mist first, which is kind of a nice one. I like the, the frosted design. Um, I'm either a clear case kind of person or a, like I said, the grip case, something like that. Um, and I have to have a good quality clear case that's not going to yellow. Um, and my problem with clear cases is I change cases a lot. So the fact that once you take it off, the back gets kind of dirty and stuff gets back up in there. Um, and then you just see it through your phone. I don't really like that, but um, nothing to do with any you know, spec cases or anything, that's just clear cases in general, but I like this one, how it matches kind of with the, uh, the green, the, the grayish, um, dark smoked, um, frost on this, uh, really goes well with the green S23 Ultra, I don't know how well you can tell on camera, um, but they're almost a match, because this green on the S23 Ultra is a very, 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 um, dark kind of light olive green, if that makes any sense, um, but very nice case. Um, it goes just flush with the camera, um, the camera cutout right there, or the camera bump right there. Um, so you don't have to worry about any rock when you put it down. It's completely flat. Your buttons right here, they are separated for the volume up and down, which I noticed on the Samsung frame case, they are not. So it's kind of hard to tell, you know, exactly where your finger is if you want to change your volume. Um, buttons are very tactile and responsive, easy to press. Um, if I do that too fast, I'm going to open up the camera. And then on the bottom down here, we do have a very nice large cutout for your S Pen, so you can pull that out very easily. Um, you can get your finger in there to you know depress it and pop it out or pop it back in. Got a cutout right here for your speaker and microphone, and then a nice large USB-C cutout right there, um, so you can accommodate many USB-C chargers. And then that is going to be it. Cut out for your microphone on top, and that is what it looks like. There is some rays on the edges here um, to protect your device when you lay it down. So that is very good. I uh, won't scratch up your screen if you put it face down, as long as you put it on a flat surface. Take this one off. They do go on there, they snap on very, very well. Um, and I do have a matte screen protector from Armor Shield on here, which I will be showing in a later review. Um, but so far these are case friendly. I'm uh, screen protector friendly, they're not affecting my screen protector. Um, and this is a case friendly screen protector as well. And then right here we have the Presidio Perfect Clear, um, 13 feet, I didn't mention that on the last one. Um, this one doesn't mention drop protection on the front, but it is on the back. Um, so 13 feet on both of these, um, microban um, to prevent you know, the case from like growing bacteria and stuff like that, again, on both of the cases right there. Um, so, you know, in these days with COVID and all that kind of stuff, any kind of protection you can get against germs and uh, stuff like that adhering to your surfaces is always a win-win. So right here we have the clear one. Again, probably one of my favorite cases if you put it on when the phone is new and the case is new um, because you don't have to worry about any fingerprints on the back side of the case or any dust or, you know, dirt or anything on the back side of the case showing through. Again, though, that is probably one of my favorite cases right here because the phone is kind of just encased, you know, in a little bit of protection, but you can still see the whole back of the phone and the sides of the phone and everything like that, um, but it won't get scratched up. Um, it's kind of like a screen protector for the whole outside of your phone, basically. Again, same camera design as the uh, the smoked one or the frosted one, um, flush with the case. Um, same buttons and everything, very tactile and responsive. Um, again, the cutouts are the same right there. So you can get your S Pen out very easily. And then you got your uh, speaker cutout, USB-C cutout right there, no issues at all. It does look like this case is slightly 
Um, the ports are slightly t uh, closer to the top on this one than they were that one, but it doesn't look like it should be an issue for most uh, most chargers and stuff like that. And the S Pen came out just fine. Um, and then we have your microphone on the top there as well. So again, very, very nice case. And then one of my all-time favorites next up is going to be the Presidio Grip 2. Go ahead and take this one off. And you don't have to worry about these falling off on their own or anything like that. The foam goes in there very nicely. Put that one off to the side. And then next up, like I said, my personal favorite, the Presidio Grip series. Um, we have 13 feet on this one, Microban, Presidio 2 Armor Cloud, um, Raised Bezel, which that one had as well. Again, that one was basically the same as the frosted one um, that was first. Go ahead and take a look at this one. All the links for these will also be down in the Amazon, or the Amazon, in the uh, video description where you can check these cases out. And of course, purchasing anything through the Amazon links in my descriptions. Support the channel at no extra cost to you. And then all time favorite case right here, nice black design. They do have a, I think like a navy blue one, which is kind of cool too. I remember back in the day they had some nice red. Um, I think it was like a red and black, like black grip red case on the 4S when I had one. I love that case. Um, very nice buttons on this. I like how the buttons are just like the raised like plastic. They're kind of separate from the separate from the case. They are very tactile and responsive. Um, you have nice grips here on the side of the case as well. Um, makes the phone very, very nice to hold. This is again, like I said, my all-time favorite case. I'm, I'm definitely leaving this one on after the video out of all the cases I have. Um, I've been waiting to, to make a video on these so I can open these up and finally use this one. Um, but same thing on this one, buttons and cutouts and S Pen are all easily accessible. No issues whatsoever there. Camera, same thing, flush, so you don't have to worry about hitting it or it rocking or anything like that. And your microphone on top as well. So very, very nice cases. Um, spec are definitely my go-to for protection um, when I need a good case. So if I'm, if I'm going somewhere and I need a nice rugged case, this is definitely my go-to right here. Um, it keeps the phone in your hand. It feels very, very solid um, and easy to hold. Not gonna slip out or anything like that. So go-to case, I'm leaving this one on for sure. These are the spec cases for the Galaxy S23 series. A lot of these are gonna be available for your S23, S23 Plus as well. Um, but of course, the phone shown in this video is the S23 Ultra. I am Colin with Tech Out. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And as always, have a great day.